Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your audio and your sound issues on your Xbox Series X. Now, the first thing I want to show you is to go up to settings right here and select this and go down to devices and connections and go to controllers and headset. In the past, there has been an issue with your controller not being up to date, and this has been causing audio issues. So we want to go to the button with the three little lines on it and go to update right here. Now, mine currently says no update available, but go to update now and just apply a fresh copy of the update to your Xbox controller. So mine is at 100% right now. All right, so let's go to next and back out and then go to the main settings menu right here and go to general, go to the right, and then go down to volume and audio options right here. And then choose the correct audio format for your TV speakers and then also your headset. So depending on what you're using. So if you're using your headset, you can try stereo on compressed you could try windows sonic for headphones just go through these different audio options until you hear decent audio then we can also go to additional options right here so you can also try allowing the pass through you can check mark this this setting will allow apps to send audio directly to your hmi device to be decoded so you can try enabling this if you're using like an audio receiver or some sort of like soundbar or something like that then you can also go to mono output right here this is going to make the left and right audio one audio so you're not going to really hear a directional all that much, but this could help you relieve some issues. So you could try this on or off. Then right here is the option mute speaker audio when headset is attached. This will turn off your TV speakers when you turn on your headset. Then here's mute navigation sounds, mute notification sounds. And then here's the chat mixer. If you want to reduce the game sound and hear the party chat a little bit more, you can do it by 80% or 50% right here. Or you can mute all sounds. So maybe this is selected and that's why you're not getting any audio. You want to go to do nothing right here and select this. And then you can select the party chat if you want to select it to your headset, your speakers or headset and speakers specifically. And then we can back out of that screen. And we want to go to audio testing and details right here and select this. And this is going to tell you what kind of audio formats you have available for your specific setup. So I don't have surround sound or Dolby digital or anything like that with my headset or my TV speakers. But on the left side of the screen, there is an option that says reset audio settings right here. Maybe simply resetting the audio settings will help your issue and resolve it. Another thing that you can do just for fun is go to audio setup right here and you can choose the audio setup. And you're going to hear sound in your left or right headset speaker or your TV speakers. And you can choose the different format and you kind of can decide which one is the best in real time. So now that we have that set up, press the Xbox button and then go on down to this setting right here, audio and music, select this. Now, if you have your headset plugged in, you're going to be able to adjust all the settings up top. So I'm going to turn on my headset. And the first option is the headset volume. So you can increase this or decrease this. Then you have the chat mixer. So my headset is now turned on. And since I have the Xbox wireless headset, I actually have a slider on my headset. So I don't have to use my controller to do this. So I'm going to turn up the headset volume to maybe like 75%. And then the chat mixer is at about 70%. So I can slide it there. And then I have mic monitoring. And mic monitoring is when you speak, you're going to hear yourself talk in your headset. And this could help with um, maybe if someone is talking around you or something like that. It'll just give you a little bit easier hearing for those situations. And then you have the TV volume. You can decrease the sound right here, or you can increase it, or you can mute your TV right here. But hopefully this video did indeed help you guys out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on your six studios.